Everybody's been wondering when are the new Kicking Their Bass TV rods coming out. If you guys want to be the first to know, all you have to do is go to kickingtheirbass.com. I will have it linked down below. There's going to be a little pop-up that pops up on the screen. It says, be the first to know. You need to enter your phone number there, and I'm going to be actually sending out updates. So if you guys want to be the first to know about the rod, you need to sign up to the texting service. These rods are going to sell out in the first 30 minutes. So you need to do this so you guys can know before anybody else. Thank you so much. Go do that now. Our second tournament of the year. We fished one two weeks ago and it didn't really go as planned. We didn't do bad, but we really think we could have won it. We made some bad mistakes during the tournament. We've learned from that. And today we're out here and we're gonna try our best today and try to take home this W and catch some good fish more importantly. We're gonna have to do that for sure. The Ogeechee River is known for a lot of small bass. There's some big ones in here. But usually these tournaments, you know, seven to 12 pounds is winning them. So last tournament, it was 10, Cody, right? Yeah. 10 pounds. 10, 10 pounds won the last tournament. We started off in this spot. We were fishing a good bit. And I turned and looked at Cody. I was like, hey, you know, it's a tidal water fishery. I was like, we need about 30 more minutes for this spot. As we were heading out, there was a, some boys coming in. And um, they're like, you catching here? We're like, oh, not yet. It's not ready. And uh, we end up going and hitting some more spots. And we come back. And uh, they were pulling out. And they looked at us. And they're like, man, you shouldn't have left early. And we're like, oh, man, they probably caught him. And they actually ended up winning the tournament. So we had the winning spot the whole time. We just could not execute. And those boys ended up beating us to it. Congrats to them, by the way. But today is a whole new day. We're ready to kick it off and uh, make it happen. Are you ready, Cody? I'm ready. Are you excited? I'm so Dude, I'm so dude. pumped. Like we I'm got focused. We, Let's get we, this. We got to zone in. We got to zone in. Just yeah. make it happen. Let's we just got to catch some big ones. Cover a lot of water. If you guys haven't checked out the pre-fishing video, go check it out. Um, we actually filmed a little bit this morning and we're just kind of checking some spots testing out our reels throwing some different baits and it was a lot of fun if you guys want to see some more tournament videos like this and tournament practices and just more of the tournament lifestyle let your boy know down in the comment section down below if you guys are new to the channel hit the subscribe button hit the notification bell also hit the like button if you guys have been enjoying the content that really helps a lot let's go ahead and get this tournament started positive the bite's gonna get better as the day goes on out going tide we're gonna catch them we got a bunch of boats behind us so they're coming can't believe i'm fishing in slides this first i put a new one of these spinner baits on too and those mud fish smacking the heck out of that other one I'm not getting that net ready, just in case. I think we'll be here for a second. Doesn't mean we can't catch some right here right now though. Yeah. Oh, oh no. I gotta drop your curl right there, bro. Drop your curl right there. Do a thing. That was a big fish. Is it bass? I don't know. Whatever it was was big. It's either a bass or a mud. I don't know. He like slammed me right at the top of the surface out from the bank. It could have been a mud. He just never had it.
couple more casts. Say we come back in about 30. Hopefully there won't be a guy here that tells us he won the tournament on his way out. Yeah. <laughs> shouldn't have left. What if the shrimp boat does the same thing that guy did to us? He shouldn't have left. Yeah, we just caught 15 bass and we're fishing for red. <laughs> I saw that. I got a flute. Yep. Yeah, he's got it. That's a bass. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god. Throw in there. He'll still eat it. I didn't hook him. That was a bass, though. I saw him. What in the world? Oh, man. He was small, but, but still, that was just crazy. I've never seen that before either. I don't know how he just didn't have the fluke all the way. Must have just never had your curl either. Oh, I got one. That's a good one, dude. I'm gonna bring him right up to you, buddy. Boom, baby. Yes, sir. Damn, yeah. Not a bad one, brother. Hey, they're here. That's a different fish than that one you just caught. Yeah. He about jerked the rod out of my hand. There we go, boys. First keeper of the day. Cody actually threw his bait right there. And one tried to eat it at the top. I threw my fluke and missed him. And then I just caught this one a couple casts later. Throw him in the box. That's the start, baby. Gut instincts. No. -uh. Get him right up to me. Keep him coasting. Mm-hmm. There we go. Come on, get him in the box. You keep casting. Yeah. Good as job. As soon as it hit the water. Good job. Money, dude. Good job. Good job, Cody. Two fish. Didn't even get my bait back on my hook. Good job, buddy. Hey, we turned that around quick. We could have had three. Catch three more. Oh, there's another one sitting there. Those two are stacked up. That sucker almost pulled a rod out of my hand. He grabbed it and he was going that way. Yeah. I got, I got one. I think it's 11. It might be 12 actually. I'm gonna measure him. Dude, there's another little guy sitting there. Yeah, you just saw that. Knew you were there, you little turd. I think you're 11. Maybe you'll be 12 for me. You are 11 and a half, uh -oh. you little turd. It's okay. Oh gosh. Good one? Yeah. Come over to me. Mm-hmm. That's a freaking fat one, boy. Yeah. Good job. He hooks at him like he was a dang 12, dude. That, dude, that's the one <laughs> that's been pestering me from earlier. Because he did the same dang thing. Oh, I got him. That's a good one, Cody. Oh, it's a freaking, I don't even know what it is. I got a gar, dude. Gar? Yeah. Like how the heck did, dude, I hooked him so perfect in the mouth too. Oh, thank you.
I would do anything to see a four pounder. I would literally do anything. I just have a hard time believing someone smoked them. Like, I just, I don't know. You got it? Oh man, what a tough day, Cody. Dude, I don't know. What a tough day. We had three fish, huh? I don't even think anyone made over that, did they? Like over three fish. I knew someone had four no, pounds. No, I think somebody had somebody else had three fish with four pounds. Yeah. It's one of the three fish with four pounds. We had three fish with three and a half. <laughs> yeah. That's the Ogeechee for you. We would have oh. got second if they paid out second, but they don't. Yeah, I know. What are we gonna get second? I don't know, Rich. Maybe. You got a, it looks like you got a good one. Well, it is the next day. We got our butts kicked, guys. We only have three fish, sadly. We should have had a limit. I just, I don't know what happened. It was a tough day on the river. Only seven pounds ended up winning, if that says anything, in a five bass tournament. So it was a tough day and uh, we had fun though. You know, we only got three, but we're gonna be back, guys. We're coming back and we're gonna catch some good ones. But today we're out here because we wanna go find some big fish. We gotta come out here and redeem ourselves. And uh, we just decided let's go out the next day, see if we can catch some big ones, and uh, show you guys some good content. So we're gonna go ahead and get out here, start fishing around, try some different things, and uh, see if we can find some big fish today. And then hopefully next week, we we'll end up smacking them really good and taking home the W. Well, let's go ahead, see if we can find some big ones. This stuff up here should be good. Right there. Oh, got him out. Oh, came off. There's a bass. <laughs> About to say that spot looked too good for them not to be one there. That yeah. current's going past it. So we're on the left side of that stump. Should be another one. Yep. Nice. Two fish sitting on the same stump. It's a little tiny guy right there on the rage curl. Not a bad little fish. I'm just on that black and blue rage curl. If you guys want to get a discount, check out any of the baits. Got my links down below. Pretty little fish. Nothing big, but there's two of them sitting up there. I mean, how, where could they just go? What, they disappear? Like, there should be one on this tree. And if there's not, I really think they all died, dude. Every day they just, they pass away. Once the tide goes down, they just all die. And then new ones just randomly come in. Uh-oh. We're good. Dude, that was so close. <laughs> Thank God that did not get you. I had a bite too, you know though. Where? Right here. Your shoulder? No. Oh right my here. god, it hit on the hat. I got him. Mud? Yeah, dude, there's, there's like a school of muds. <laughs> okay. I almost slapped your ham, dude, and I would have felt so bad. You almost slapped my eyeball ham. That would not have been good. Over some stupid muds. We had a almost a double up on muds. I would have rather had a shark. Facts. This is your freshwater shark. Thank you. That was pretty easy. 
It's pretty clean, really. I'll bet you there's more up there. Yeah. I'm ready. I'm ready for him to. That was a good bass. Dude, that was like a dang. Mm. Did you see it? Yeah, well, I didn't see it. I saw it splash. I didn't see it. Body. That's like a two and a half pounder, dude. Dude, he bit you. Yeah, he did. Unless that's a different one. This looks good. Uh, ooh, there he is. Say that looks so dang good, dude. It's a good little bass. Here we go, guys. One on a spinner bait. Nice one. It's been pretty, pretty tough. This is a good looking little spot, though. Finally got one to eat on it. Not a big one, but pretty good on a Strike King spinner bait. Hit it pretty good. Finally, some that ate. We've had a ton of bites, guys. They're just not commit. Just end up slapping it. They won't eat it all the way. We've been riding around for a good bit, just trying to find some deeper water. Um, our boat a second ago was sitting in a foot of water, so we're just idling. We can't pick up on plane anywhere. It's super low right now. It's lower than I wanted it to be. If we would have got out here a little bit earlier, I think we would have hit it right, but it's pretty dang low. So we're just trying to find spots to fish right now. The river's, I, I'm telling you, there's barely any water in this river right now. But I think we're gonna get on some fish here in a moment. We've, got, we've had a lot of bites. They're just not really committing to it. So I think we'll find them in a minute. Ha, ha, ha. That's a big one, dude. Big. I think it's a big bass. Yeah, is it? Oh gosh, it is, dude. That's what we're looking for, huh? What I've been looking for the last few days, baby. Look at that one. That's a good fish, dude. I want to say that's the full payback on these fish, but that's a freaking good one for the Geechee right there. That's the ones that we need in the tournament, Cody. Some big boys. Yeah. Imagine five of those. Yeah. I was about to say that's a big one. Dude, he's stuck. Look at the boil. Please still be on there, baby. Please still be on there. Cody, this is a monster of it. Oh yeah, he's on there. I got him. Gosh, he's not as big as I thought, but he's a good one. Look at that one. That's a fat dude, ain't it? That's a pretty fish. That is a nice one. Well, man, we already beat our bag in the tournament, easy. This fish is bleeding out, wanted to get on the carpet and get her back in the water. I actually hooked her in the corner of the mouth and her tongue's bleeding. <laughs> if there's a brute out here, that's a freaking brute. Such a stubby fish. Thank you, buddy. I thought he was a massive one. He got stuck in that tree. I believe you, dude. Your rod tip was like, no way. Like the way that he bit, the way that he felt when his head was shaking, I seriously thought I had a four plus. Yeah. And the spot looked like it, you know, it looked like there would have been a big one there. But yeah. dude, I'll tell you like the fish that we've caught guys already, and it's been pretty tough. Haven't been out here too long, but we already have a, <laughs> some good ones. It's like the size that we're catching today is a lot better. Dude. Nice. Not a big one, but a keeper. He's a good one, yeah. He's a keeper. Keeper, keeper, squeaker, squeaker. still be up there. Dude, what Dude. the hell? <laughs> Dude. Oh my that God. was stupid. 
That fish is taking all. I just want to feel what you're feeling. What does it feel like? It feels like a good fish for like a split second. Oh my gosh. Dude, he took all for the three different times. I'm feeling sad right now. <laughs> I want to say, dude, like he like grabs it. it, it dude, it just knocked Again? It. Yeah, it knocked it hard that I time. I don't feel what you're feeling. Maybe he wants us. Let it yeah. Go. That's not it. That's a brand. 100%. Whatever just hit me, the other one might not be. That might be why he's running so fast with it, dude. See, that one, it was like tick, tick, tick. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, my God. What was bro. that? A sturgeon? That was a sturgeon. Does it, was it really? Yeah. Oh, dude. I've been wanting to see it. You saw it like clear I as day? whole body. Is it, how big was he? Dude, it was probably four foot. Oh my god. I've been waiting to see one. That was cool. Maybe he'll jump again. See, that's wild. That's There's crazy. sturgeon in here, dude. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. We got some revenge on these fish. We're going to be coming back and fishing some more of these tournaments. Hopefully, we'll be able to get it on some of these big ones. We got on some decent fish this afternoon. Only we're out here for a few hours. There it goes. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did, please hit the like button. Let me know if you guys want to see some more tournament videos and practice videos. We enjoy coming out here on the river. We just got to get those big ones next time. But thank you so much for the support, and I'll catch you guys in the next video.